welcome back to another episode of Room Factory Frontier. Hi guys! <laughs> we're back and we're gonna do awesome things today. Cause you know what today is? Today is a freaking holiday and look at that lag. Holy crap. Alright, well we're just gonna have to deal with it because I was trying to fix it and I seem to make it worse and now I can't make it go away. So, um, I do apologize for the lag. Anyway, so today it's a holiday and that means loot. That mysterious guy that, um, the peddler, you remember him? Yeah, he's here today. And that means exciting things for Sparky and I. That means we can get the forge. And if we can get the forge, we can grow. No, we don't grow stuff. I'm just kidding. No, we can forge crap and upgrade our equipment. Now, I did, um, my turnips did grow here, so we're gonna sell them. Let's see how much money we have. $4,000, guys! $4,000! I'm so excited. And then look at all the stuff I can sell. And I did keep some iron and we need to keep two turnips. So let's stick the rest in here. 2,000 bucks. That is not bad at all. We could probably afford a barn here soon too. It's you. Good morning. I just came to chat my young cross. When I see the flowers scattered, it reminds me of my old friends. I thought we would always be together, but now they're all gone. Did everyone move to the big city where th when they grew up? <laughs> Something like that. Everyone became free. They're all dead! Holy crap, guys! They're all dead! Wah. Anyway, so we don't have the barn, but let's go check up on Mist and see if she's over here. She probably isn't, but it doesn't hurt the look, right? I don't think so. That's okay, though. But um, it is the seventh also. Meaning somebody else is moving into the town. So why don't we go check the clock tower first before that? Uh, before we go on. So let's let's go do that. Check the clock tower. Look how pretty it is. It's so beautiful everywhere. I love this game. Guys, this game is awesome. Did you know that? It's freaking sweet. Alright, let's go in here though. Let's see what's what's going on so we can go in here now. That's awesome. Who's here? Let's see what this is. You know, I honestly, I hate to say this, but I don't even know what that room is for. I don't know what it is. I haven't even beat this game yet, but I'm playing it for you guys. Makes me a very unexperienced gamer. Spank me, I dare ya. Oh, but let's see if anybody's up here. I don't think um, he's gonna... Oh, here he is. Are you from this village? Yes, but I just moved here. I see. I am the same. My name is Kendall. I heard about this village from Sister Stella, so I came all the way here. I'm Sparky. I do some farm work around here in the village. Why did you come to this village, Kano? Because of that whale island. I do certain research on magic that uses runes. <coughs> I retired. Uh, my chronic free... illness. <clears throat> Excuse my me. Chronic illness. But... Uh, are you okay? I'm fine. I heard about that island from Stella and decided to come here. Is that right? If you have any questions about runes or spirits, you can come ask me. Thank you. Yeah, so this is our man. This is our magic man. Oh, I didn't know you could ask him questions. Good morning. The clock tower itself has this mysterious air about it. I find that very interesting. Okay, so there's Kano, our new guy. Now, he is going to bring two pretty ladies into the town. One's too young for us, but the other one is not. And we will look at her and gaze at afar and dream that she is ours. Wait, no, I'm just kidding. We want selfie, remember? Let's go see her. Oh, Selfie, we're coming to see you. I know you don't know we like you yet, but you're gonna know because we'll be giving you stuff here soon. I just don't know what you like, but we'll figure it out here in a few days. Hiya! Mm-mm-mm. Why is it so messy in here? What are you doing here in the first place? I asked Laura to let me stay here. Well, this library has a lot more books than it looks. I like it. I organized them all so it's clean now. Time to start reading. Organized? Do you call this organized? Yeah, all the books I want to read are in the perfect position for me to reach them. Oh, by the way, I discovered the new book after organizing them. I'll sell you the books I don't want, so just come talk to me about it. 
All right, our silly selfie. Good morning. Love of our life here. You seem so lively so early. I wonder what I should read next. I can't wait. She's obsessed with books. Now, do you remember that, that time when I said this library was clean? Yeah, it's not that way no more. So that's why I said appreciate it. Because it's not like that no more. But that's okay. Because we still have selfies. You can read the books by pressing the A button in front of the bookshelf. <gasps> she knows we're playing a game, guys. Hurry! You're free to read Hi. any book here. Run. But there are she still knows. lots of Get books I haven't Get read yet. Be Run. sure not to take those. I'll sell you the books that I don't need anymore. Oh, thanks, Selfie. You're so sweet. All right, let's leave Selfie to her reading obsession. Um, hopefully one day we can break that, because that might be a bother in the relationship. Anyway, so usually loot's up here on a holiday, but since we're not on an actual holiday, it's just really Sunday, we're going to go over and talk to him, because we want that forge. We want to know if we can afford the forge, because I want it real bad, so we can water and stuff, we can upgrade, all sorts of things, get new swords, oh, it's really sweet, this game is awesome. Hi there, you're a new face, aren't you? Um, are you from this village? Yeah, I just moved here, my name is Sparky. Nice to meet you, I'm a traveling painter and my name is Luke. But I'm still just a fledgling painter, so I'm also a peddler on the side. Oh, really? What kind of paintings do you do, Luke? I paint all kinds of scenery. I think it's fate that we met here, Sparky. Tell me if you need anything. The painting will be sold at a bargain, so please buy any when you catch your fancy. Thank you kindly. I like this guy a lot, honestly. I wish he was one of the girls in the game, because... He just has a way about it, brother, and I really like it. What would you like? I need some facilities. We want the forge. No. Okay, the handy forge. I was like, wait! The forge is not $10,000 at the beginning of the game. But but it's only two, so we're So let's get ourselves the handy forge. You can use up to two materials to forge weapons and tools. Alright, so we know how to do this. I'll show you guys here in a while. Once we get it all set up. Yes, Alrighty, I'll have your stuff delivered to you. And he likes super magical. I mean, I can go home now. Morning. So the happiest of the game. Anyway, we can go to our home now, and it'll be there. We don't gotta wait no days, nothing. Let's get the um, also get the happy kitchen. For future references, I mean, because we will need to start cooking here soon. Get our cooking skills up. Because once we start dungeon crawling, Alrighty, super laggy I'll dungeon, have your stuff. Then yeah, we'll be needing some. And then what's we'll the maker? Because I want to get a seed maker, but that's five thousand. I lied. To you guys. Yeah, I'm terrible. I'm not. Cooking tools. Oh, we definitely need a frying pan. That's gonna be our best bet because we need some fish. But of course, we don't have a fishing pole yet. But we'll get that here soon. The days in this game, right? Yeah. Alrighty, I'll have your. Let's see what else he got before I let him go. And this isn't gonna be a very exciting episode. We're just gonna buy the forge and go make some crap. Black we'll furniture. Mini fridge. At five thousand. Okay. Thanks All for right, the. Thank you, Luke. You're great. I'm so glad you showed up today. Maybe. Should we buy something else? I mean, what about the Alchemist Lab? Because he's only here once a week. We don't have enough for anything now. How about we buy the pot? Let's go buy some pot, guys. And get high. Just kidding. Bad for you. Don't. He looks high, though. He's like, oh, yeah. Alrighty. I'll have your stuff. Let's go make some paintings and build some forges. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're going to run home really quick. And we're going to go and create shiz. Like a better watering can. And we don't even have to walk. We can just, like, fly there. Fly, guys. Isn't that crazy? 
we're off to see the wizard! Yay, we're home, guys! We're home! We're home! Okay, let's go. And here we have it! This is our forge! So now we can take stuff like our lumber. We can make a chop we can make a chopping axe with our iron. But let's go with our watering can first. Be the tin can. Ready guys? This is awesome. Okay, let's do this. We're gonna get it right on the green. Boom! Oh. Yeah! That's awesome. Okay, so we got that. Let's do our hammer. Let's do we gotta do everything. So I that's why I kept some iron so we could do everything. I can fail. Thankfully, when you fail though, you can try again. <laughs> Easy as that. Alright, we got the iron hammer. Chopping axe. Alright, sounds good. Means we can take less chops at something. And, um, it'll be more powerful if you don't, you don't have to chop as much, and it reduces the RP. That's a nice thing. So we got everything. The tin can. Except the hoe. We, we, haven't, we haven't upgraded our hoe yet. We need better quality about it. There we go. We have this, the poles. We can't do the poles yet, though. So we'll have to wait for our lovely cinnamon to arrive in town. But here we go. Now, that does take RP consumption, as you can tell at the top left. That does take your RP. Which isn't bad, really. I mean, because it kind of makes up for it. The game does itself. Um, but let's take our sickle out. And we'll sickle some shiz. We'll sickle the weeds. No, actually, we're going to sickle our, our grass here. Now look what we can do now. We can hit B, and boom! We got magical attacks. Boom! Now we don't have to do one at a time. Same with my watering can. I don't have to do one at a time anymore. Ready for this? Ready? Boom! Now I know you guys, I always cut it out when I water, but it takes forever to water. Like, forever. So I'm very happy that we got this. Alright, now that we got everything done, I know I need to clean my field, it's looking terribly messy. But we need to wait for three so we can... <sighs> go to the bathhouse and heal up. So we're gonna go around the town and just talk to everybody on this lovely holiday. And see if there's anybody new. We're gonna buy a few turnips. Oh, he's not open today though. Next time, we'll buy a few turnips. That will be Sunday. Sunday? No, it'll be Monday by turnips on Monday. Also, this plot is empty right now, but later on we will have some rich snotty girl come in. Yeah, she's a grand old time, let me tell ya. Oh, but this cute little purple elephant comes. It's so adorable, and then they, they're their best friends, and it's so cute. Ooh, touching, right? Oh, here's your niece. Hello. I'm thinking of some new dishes to make for the guests at the inn. I wonder what I should make. Chocolate. Chocolate everything because I'm a woman. Chocolate. I don't want to go to Danny. Oh, Danny might be open on the holiday. Just kidding. Why would you do that? that Hello again today, Melody. Hi! It's so warm. Welcome. The bath is perfect as always today. We can that will be bath ten gold. Thank you! That's really not bad for the price. I mean, if she built this whole log of springs all by herself, and she's only charging 10 bucks for it, I mean, that's Oh, cool. that's... So, there's gonna be one day when I really need her. Oh, we hear something. Here comes one of our bathroom events. Mom, let me wash your back for you. Why, thank you. Hmm? Why are you so quiet all of a sudden? I just thought that you have really nice skin. <laughs> oh, come on. You're much younger than me. Of course you look better. You need to have more confidence in yourself. Or as you can tell, Sparky's a little bit of a person. Just a little bit. Because for some reason you hear a naked woman on the other side of the bath. 
She's not even that full naked, but... And you pass out. Get the back. That is dangerous, Sparky. Hi! Okay. So warm. I'd want to take a lunchbox with me and go drinking while looking at flowers on days like this. This... This oddly reminds me of my fiancé's parents. That's, that's Cause he drinks and then she's just a trooper altogether. How you doing? Oh, Sparky, this is the woman's bath. You're a bad boy. Has the steam scrambled your brain, Sparky? Ladies only. Sparky, I'm gonna start to get angry. You went to Well Island? How'd you get to such a high place? Sparky, you can fly? <laughs> That's it, Eunice. Oh, your inner innocence is so cute. <laughs> I just love it. Anyway, so what we're gonna do now, because we're finally done. We got a good forge. We need to upgrade our sword thing. We need a book. Let's see if she'll sell us a book, or at least how much it'll be. But what we need is a book that's gonna upgrade our sword and stuff. Because right now we have just a, a normal sword that's not very good. Yay! Concentrating. I should leave her alone. <laughs> well, I guess this place is the perfect place for her. Really? Great! Alright, let's find something. Let's make weapons. So we need a thousand bucks. Jewelry, lab, chef, skilled steamy. Frying pan. Let's get this one. You really come again! We'll need it eventually. And right now we have the money, so why not? Tomorrow we'll come back. Come say hi to Selfie. We'll figure out what she likes. Give her something nice. And go from there. Because, um, we're gonna need all those books in the end anyway. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for the storyline now. We're gonna... I know it's 3 o'clock, so we're just gonna kind of level up. Oh, well, Island's not in the sky today. Oh, darn. Well, it looks like I'm just gonna tend to the fields then. Now, um... Originally, I'm probably just going to end the episode and finish the fields without recording. Um, but I do want to ask you guys. Um, I did download the Rune app. Thankfully, one of my, my fellow subscribers had told me that. I'm very thankful because it's going to be a lot of help when we start concentrating on the runes. Those are the things flying around in the sky. They're called runies. Now, um... Oh, I just lost my train of thought. I just... I don't know. Are you guys enjoying the series? What do you think about the game? It's really fun. Huh? I enjoy it a lot. I mean, honestly, I love Harvest Moon games, but this one just has so much aspect to it. You have your farming, you have your love life, you have dungeon crawling, you have the forgery, you can upgrade everything. I mean, I know you can upgrade in the other games, but you're limited to just farming tools. So these games are really nice if you just like a simple RPG along with a farming simulation game. It's a really nice game for that. Um, now, it, get kind of the, it gets kind of confusing when it comes to the runies because you have to keep them at least in check. Because if you don't, um, then your crops die. And we all hate it when our crops die. So that's why I got that Rudy calculator. We're just going to finish with the fields today. I do apologize, this episode wasn't very interesting, but we got the forge, so we're doing good. Uh, we're already at 20 minutes, that's why I decided not to go dungeon crawling. Because it wouldn't take it too long, but we do need to go to the, the fin on Whale Island, because we need a cutscene to go on there. So next episode, um, if there's nothing else to do, that's what we'll be doing. We'll be going to uh, get to the next part of the storyline. Or we're gonna meet somebody new. So, and anyway, she's amazing. She's definitely amazing. Definitely my second choice if I was to marry somebody in the game. But right now we're at selfie, and we'll stick with selfie unless otherwise um, told. But I think we'll do selfie because she's pretty interesting. I never actually thought about her until um, you guys brought her up. So that'll be nice. All right. Well, it looks like it's five o'clock. Rosetta's gonna be over here soon. Where are you, Rosetta? We've met her once, and then we haven't really talked to her since. Let's see if we can break these giant rocks. 
mean, we gotta start tilling the land. Getting more crops out. Oh, there she is. Aha! Super strength right there. She's walking like she's on the moon. One slow step, Rosetta. One more slow step, Rosetta. That was supposed to be the mankind. Here she is. She's coming to nag at us for selling weeds and stuff. Good evening. I'm here to pick up the items for today. If I didn't do this, neither of us would make any money. Let's see. Oh. oh, a turnip. You've got some nerve. I welcome anything that brings profit to my store. Whew. Done. Now you and me and my customers will be all be happy. I'll be back tomorrow. I'll be sure to fill up the shipping box with crops before then. Thanks, Rosetta. You're so awesome. Can I hit you with my hoe? It's upgraded. This village already has a general store. Do you have time to be collecting the things in the shipping box? It's okay. You snooze, you lose, you know? You have to keep expanding your market. She's very market oriented, which is not bad at all. I mean, whatever works for her, right? So, she is definitely another bachelorette if you guys like her. I'm not really into her. Honestly, selfie seems like the best way to go so far. Anyway, looks like it's 5 o'clock. Time for Sparky to hit the hay, go to bed, and we'll finish up tomorrow and go to Well Island and get the next part of the story. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, like and subscribe and I hope to see you next episode. Goodbye.